Welcome to another unboxing here. Oh, channel, it's all about me. I know that sounds super hedonistic. But I'm the guy getting all the misfits. So let's check what we've got this week. More produce. I looked up what this is called. It's like frizzee. It is, we've been having bacon, lettuce, and tomato sandwiches off the charts. So good, so excited about it. Woo, first time I've gotten one of these. Now this is it. You gotta remember that everything is organic produce in here. Next thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to the store, we're gonna do some shopping, and we're gonna do a comparison and see whether or not we're actually saving some money here, but check those out. These are some hot peppers. Super excited about that. That is, peppers go in a lot of stuff. I like to fire roast them, create some emulsions, use those as sauces. Um, really challenges my creativity in cooking. Beautiful color, love those, those look great. Fruit continues to be a common theme in what we're getting here from Misfits. And I will tell you this, the flavor, the texture, of the fruit that we're getting out of here is spectacular, off the charts. These apples are great. We've been making it uh, kind of like an applesauce. Cook those down a little bit every single week. So good with a little bit of uh, yogurt. Beets. We had golden beets last time. We got purple beets this time. Fantastic. They're really sweet. Takes a long time to cook these down in the oven, but if you do it right, they are so good. Excellent, excellent produce. Can't say enough about how excited I am about this. Here's one that I haven't, I don't think I've eaten a pear in a very long time. These specifically, looks like these are red Bartlett pears. And if you know anything about pears, the texture of pears sometimes can be grainy. A Bartlett pear has a little bit smoother texture. These are probably, I think, what you're looking for. Three of those, I'm excited about that. I don't even know what that is. Check that out. Isn't that something that's a little bit different? Looks like a fruit. After I eat it, I'll get back to you and tell you what it is. Continuing with our theme of citrus. Now, I've been using the lime in some of the salsa that I make, okay? Anytime that I make a salsa, any of my dishes, uh, where I make anything that needs a little bit of acidity, Got a lot of lime that I throw in there. These are Vidalia onions. These are a little bit smaller than what we typically get at the store. Ooh. White onions. These were chopping up. I use onions in everything. It's an aromatic. So I said last time that I was gonna cut back on the celery. This time I actually went and selected a few things left a few other things up to grabs, whatever I could get, you know, whatever they chose. And uh, I will tell you this, celery, onions are always fantastic. Love those anytime I can get my hands on those. I'm still struggling with this. I, you guys comment in the comments down below. What am I doing with lemons? Lemons right now, they feel wasted putting these in a glass of water. There's got to be something else that I can do. Someone mentioned that I can put these on fish. Totally agree. I can brighten things up there, but I'm still struggling with that. Limes, I know what to do with them. Corona. Not coronavirus, but coronas. They, they need a lime. Another beet. Fantastic. Oh. Last two times we got spaghetti squash. This time we get a butternut squash. Fall, very fall themed. Fantastic, very excited about that. And that's our unboxing. Again, Misfits Market, check it out. Tell me what you think, what you like, what you don't like in the comments below. Look forward to doing this again next week. Have a great week, guys.